from Dawn Shade Box of Nation. <laughs> Hey, Roland, who hit harder, man? You a tank, man? That's a stupid question. I'm bigger than I'll punch harder than you. What's the most thing? What do we think the most dangerous? Man, I'm thing the hardest punch. puncher in the world on my way. Honestly, pound for pound, I'm I might be the hardest puncher. Me and Water are probably hardest puncher is pound for pound. So, what do you think is the most dangerous thing about tanks, man? Well, I mean, the most dangerous things is power, and the thing is, I'm a harder puncher. So, you think it's gonna go the distance? Fuck no. He ain't gonna knock, get knocked down one round. Shit, I mean, I don't think anybody in this damn place thinks that shit going the distance. I don't think anybody thinks it's going the distance. A anyone over here think it go the distance? No, hell no. Fuck no, she ain't going the distance. He gonna get knocked the fuck out. Bet your house. Hey, listen, Devin might fight uh, JoJo next. Devin who Haney cares about Devin? Uh, who cares about Devin Haney? I'm saying, who you got in that fight though? I, I just don't care about the fight because it's a Devin Haney fight. Right. Devin Haney fights are literally irrelevant. Like they're literally he a boring ass fighter. He can't fill up seats. This shit sold out. He can't even fucking sell a damn fucking ticket. I know this you've been putting up a lot of memes about tanks. I mean, a lot of people take that, okay, this man don't this man don't respect tanks. Power he don't respect tank. Is that true? I mean I don't, I don't really know how to answer that question. I mean, I'm gonna just fuck them up. Simple as that. And I, I do the exact same shit always. I, I, I haven't changed. I've been the exact same person always. Hey, right? Rolly, so you talk about power. What else are you gonna bring to the to the ring that's gonna uh, defeat, uh, help you defeat? Uh, like I said, I don't need to bring anything. He's gonna run right into something because he's stupid. So you don't think he has the, the boxing skills to confront you and inside he, the ring? But that's the thing I don't get. Every motherfucker here always talking about boxing skills, boxing skills. He's not that fucking talented. He gets his eyes fucking shut every single fight. And literally every single fight he gets his eyes shut. He's not that talented. He's a he's a weight bully. Bro, the, uh, my girl loves the OnlyFans, man. Hey, subscribe to my OnlyFans. Yeah, man. My dick longer than Tank's arms. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> you're, really, you're gonna stick to the one round uh, knockout, huh? First oh, yeah, you're gonna get knocked out. Isn't first round, huh? First. Yeah, what is it? Like, but everybody talk about his boxing skills, right? But he literally gets punched by everybody in the gym. And also, that's the reason he's he, he fucking punchy. He punchy. He's never gonna be able to fight after this shit. He's never gonna be able to fight again after this shit because he won't be able to process anything. We're gonna have to fucking have a fucking special home for him, a fucking roller, uh, a fucking cart to fucking push him around. Everybody knows you're an aggressive fighter. Are you gonna remain aggressive with, with Tank? Cause he's aggressive too. So you gonna like take it to Even him? easier for me. Even easier for me. Everybody wanna run around in circles with me. And this guy's just gonna come right forward. Simple as that. Easy for me. Easy knockout. Easy night. Alright, well. Never stop. Love it. Because you're a lover. I'm a lover. <laughs> you have nothing but positive, positive things to say about everybody. I'll greet this day with love in my heart. Right, Abram? I'll greet this day with love in my heart. Hey, you feel like you feel like you fought anybody with you his know, power you know, though? He, he gave me a 50 page. Everybody not, he, knows you have power. He's not gonna hit me. He's not. He's not. He's not gonna hit me. It's not even. He, he's I'm not even gonna get close. But it's good. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is the big day. SMPs at Scout Carolinas. I need a real restoration. This is my makeover right here. Fellas, I've got some great news for you. If you've lost your hair or have a receding hairline, the time has come when you can finally get your hairline back through a process called scalp micropigmentation. So here's how it works. It's a hair tattoo that replicates the look of your hair follicles when you have fully shaved it down. So to get this hookup, make sure you follow and contact my man Scalp Carolinas on Instagram. 
All right, now check this out, guys. If you're looking to repair eczema scars, burns and bruises, dark spots and blemishes, then this right here is the perfect product for you guys. It's called L.O. Key Face and Body Oil. Athletes and top-ranking boxers, they're also using it after training to reduce swelling, inflammation, and to ease the pain. So get yours today. Go to LODeKey.com, like them on Facebook, and follow them on Instagram. Get ready to take your striking game to the next level with the Focus Ball. Dramatically improve footwork, timing, head movement, hand-eye coordination, reflex, and overall fight IQ. It's lightweight and extremely portable, so you can train every time, everywhere. When you don't have a coach to do mitt work, get a focus ball. When you don't have a heavy bag to hit, get a focus ball. When you don't have a sparring partner, get yourself a focus ball. And when you just want to have fun punching and kicking, get a focus ball. When you train with the focus ball, you train your eyes and your brain to read punches so that you can hit and not get hit. Making this very simple device a must-have for all combat sports athletes and enthusiasts alike. So if you want to take your striking game to the next level, don't wait. Get the focus ball now.